¿Cómo, uh, ¿Cómo comienza la compañía? Jo bueno, más bien, ¿cómo comienza Johnny Black? How did you get started? Yeah, man. So, uh, español o inglés? O español. Eh, eh, However you feel. Bilingüe, whatever you feel yeah. is easier. We, we understand <clears throat> it. So, so, I think it's important to, to um, kind of point out, right? Um, I was born in Cali, Colombia, uh, uh, South America. Our culture, like, like Mexican culture, Salvadoran culture, yeah. very festive, always fun, always party, always having drinks. It's just, it, it's in our blood, right? So growing up, um, the city that we're from specifically, it's a big party city. They 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 call it the uh, La Capital de Mundial de la Salsa, the, mm -hmm. the salsa capital of the world, right? So growing up in our household, everything, always music, music. My dad was never a DJ, but he, always, like, he collected um, LPs back in the day, salsa nice. LPs. So we always grew up with that. So funny thing, man, my dad had uh, two Technique 1200s. He, and he wasn't a DJ, he, yeah. just, he just had them because for his records. And so, um, I'll tell a quick fun, funny, not funny now, not funny then story. Uh, in seventh grade, you know, uh, seventh or eighth grade, uh, my dad's at work. Uh, I come home from school and, and I'm, I'm into hip hop. I'm a big hip hop guy, right? So I'm like, man, I hear like the DJ scratch and blah, blah, blah. So I get two of his salsa records. By that time, I know how to turn the system oh, on. Sure. I, you know, So I turn it on. I get the records. I don't know how to scratch, but I'm scratching <laughs> all that. <laughs> I end up messing up his needles. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah, I end up messing up his needles. A little too much so, pressure. 100%. Yeah. So, you know, I'm like, whatever, I didn't even notice. Put everything back, he got home. Boom, like the next day, he's like, hey, um, man, did you touch my sound system? Oh, and of course, what I say? <laughs> no, no, hell no, no, of course not. And so it was my, my brother and I, he and my brother wasn't into music, so my dad knew it was me. And now having kids, like, I know when my son's lying to me. My dad knew it was me. So he's like, are you, are you yeah, sure? Yeah. And I'm like, no, no, of course not. Well, I ended up getting my ass beat. Damn. Like, yeah, it was it probably the worst ass whooping oh, of my shit. life. Back in the day, you 100%. Could oh, you could do that. Yeah, yeah, 100%. <laughs> yeah. This was like, this is like 96, 97. Oh, oh yeah, you could do that. Yeah. So so anyway, though, man, I, I like to tell that story because um, those two techniques that I got my ass beat for yeah. were actually the first uh, uh, pair of techniques that I DJed on. He ended oh, up, way. you know, giving them to me down the line oh, once shit, I got serious nice. about it. You still have them? I do. Yeah, oh, yeah. Shit, yeah. So I, I actually, I, I ended up, um, I ended up doing like a, like a custom paint job on them. They're candy yeah. red. I don't even take them out anymore. I have them more like just as a. That's gonna be a family heirloom. As a mess, uh, as a memory of that ass whooping from '97. <laughs> <laughs> is, that, is that right? Yeah. <laughs> Man, I just bought it. Okay, so if you like that clip, we have another one for you over here. If you want to watch the entire episode, click over here. Okay. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, you see, you guys, see.